Another is the famous story of Ali ibn Mahziyar. Many of you might have heard the story. I'll mention just one bit and just tell you, give you some context. Ali ibn Mahziyar, brothers and sisters, was a man who went to Hajj 20 times in the hope of meeting his Imam. 20 times. That's not, I mean, it's one thing to say it. If you go to Hajj 20 times in this day and age, it's, it's unheard of. And yet imagine doing it back in those days where you had to ride a mule and a camel and 20 times performing the pilgrimage year after year. And by the way, 20 years of Hajj, 20 years, eventually he goes to Mecca, he pleads and he begs. He knocks on that door and the door is finally open. He's guided by this young man to the outskirts of the city of Mecca. He is shown a tent that sits atop a hill. He sees there is light emanating from that tent. He climbs the hill, he enters the tent, he sits down in the presence of his master. Al-Hujjat ibn al-Hasan al-Askari, fidahu arwahu al He doesn't utter a word out of respect, only to hear the Imam say, Ya Ibn Mahziyar, where have you been? Inna kunna nantadhiruka layla nahar. We have been waiting for you day and night. Ya Hujjat ibn al hasan I've been waiting for you. He said to the Imam, Ya Ibn Rasulullah, I would have come, I would have come earlier. I've been yearning to come. I, I couldn't find someone to guide me to you, to show me the way. What am I supposed to do? The Imam said to him, Ya Ibn Mahziyar, is it that you didn't have a guide to bring you here? Or is it that you need to look at your own actions? لا ولكنكم تجبرتم على ضعفاء المسلمين. No, that's not the case. Do you know what your problem is? The Imam diagnosed his problem, which is something that we all suffer from. He said to him, you were concerned with making more and more money. 